In today's video, I put together a list of five easy to care for marine fish that are great for a 50 gallon aquarium. Coming in at number five is the Banghai Cardinal Fish. Now, Banghai Cardinal Fish are great for beginners because they're a nice, peaceful fish that gets along with a peaceful community of fish in your reef aquarium. So if you're not planning a predator tank and you're looking for a peaceful community, Banghai Cardinal Fish is a great fish for a 50 gallon aquarium. This fish can be a little shy, keeps to itself, but it has striking black and white markings on its body and it's just an awesome, well-rounded fish that you can enjoy and you can keep more than one in your aquarium at a time so if you want a small school or group of these fish in your aquarium you can absolutely do that moving on to fish number four and that's going to be the royal grandma fish now this fish is a vibrant fish that sports a nice purple and yellow gradient making it a real showstopper for your reef aquarium. Not only are they a very peaceful fish, but they add a level of intrigue to your aquarium as they like to hide in the rock work. So usually when you first get a royal grandma, at least in my experience, as soon as you put them in the tank, they will find a spot in your aquarium and hide right away. So you may not see them initially upon introducing them to your tank, but once they get comfortable, they'll start to come out and interact. If you're worried about this fish when you add it to your tank, put some food in the aquarium and see if it comes out to eat. It's usually just fine because the Royal Grandma also likes to keep to himself and stay in the rock work. And it kind of creates its own little territory that you'll see it pop in and out of. Now coming in at number three is gonna be the six line wrasse. Whenever setting up an aquarium, it's always good to pick out fish that are gonna be hard workers for you and help keep your aquarium clean, whether that's a fish that picks algae off of the rock work or a fish like the six line wrasse. The six line wrasse is great pest control for your tank. And if you haven't seen the video that I made about the six line wrasse, go ahead and check that out after this video. I'll leave the link in the description. But the six line wrasse is a very lively fish that exhibits an array of colors from greens to blues to purples. It's a beautiful striking fish to add to your reef aquarium. Not only are they visually captivating, but like I mentioned, they are great at pest control in the reef tank. Now coming in at number two, where most people put this fish at number one, is the adorable Ocellaris clownfish. This is a popular fish in the aquarium industry, and it's a great peaceful fish for your peaceful community reef tank. This colorful and iconic fish is known for its playful personality, and it's striking orange and white patterns. They are incredibly hardy, making them a perfect choice for beginners and not to mention their symbiotic relationship with anemones, whether you get an Ocellaris clownfish or skunk clownfish. And if you decide to get an anemone later on, they are a perfect match. And it's just so much fun to watch them swim around in and out of the anemones and just watch that relationship they have with the anemones it just adds a touch of wonder to your aquarium now coming in at number one this is one of my all-time favorite fish to have in a reef aquarium they're just a beautiful stunning gorgeous fish to look at and they're a great beginner intermediate fish to have in a 50 gallon aquarium or more and that is the Midas Blenny. The Midas Blenny with its vibrant golden color and its charming personality definitely adds a ray of sunshine to any reef aquarium that houses this fish and it's known for its amusing antics as it likes to back in and out of a crevice that it has found in your rock work. It creates a little home for itself and it likes to swim in and out of that hole. And just the way that it swims like uh, with like an eel type motion in your reef tank is just awesome to look at. The Midas Blenny is sure to steal your heart as it loves to perch and peek around your rock work in your aquarium. It's it's a great fish to have. I really enjoy the Midas Blenny that I have in my reef aquarium and I know that you will too. Now when looking to add any of these fish to your reef aquarium, be sure to continue to do your research. If you'd like to know more about how to care for this fish right here, go ahead and click or tap your screen to watch that. Thank you so much for watching this video, for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and I will see you in the next one.